So our country people, now they message that from the leader of our War of Liberation, the president of the Ambazonian Governing Council, Dr. Cho Lucas Ayeba. He talks say Cameroon Iran be defeated as a regime of occupation, a regime for occupation that they manifest themselves by the, the occupier being able to conduct government business as usual. And so far, Cameroon, it can be defeated in that case. They don't do government as usual inside our territory anymore because of our activities for self-defense and for liberation. Cameroon, it can be left now for beginning the organized fake rallies with no residents around and people the way that they import them from abroad like the one way Diongote, it became sure and for instance Bamenda and for instance Boya. For Bamenda, Unasisi will be arrest some of those people the way they become for the Diongote a meeting. They will come up for Babanki, where they be pay them by people where they are for Yaoundé. You know, be being a people for Bamenda. It is sure that they will be defeated already. And they will rely now on those propaganda for project themselves, let's see, they still be in control. Cameroon, it will try for, for, for attempt to re-establish political control by installing and reinstalling SDOs and DOs, and uh, it has failed completely. Ambazonian, they are being called by the, the leader of our war of liberation to show commitment, not be just goodwill for this, our liberation phase. And it, it talks uh, for international law, the law of ter territoriality, it, it gives obligation for people the way they control territory, for them not for just provide security but for get obligation for provide certain services so it will require we for demand tax liberation tax for our people them the doc dr chuayaba he also explained say all people for diaspora the organization them they need to pay liberation tax and all man way there for diaspora if he travel for go for ground zero where they pay visa free for la republic he also need for pay understand say need for at least give some token to pay also for liberation tax for the Ambazonian, their fighters and for ground. And it also talks if you come up for diaspora, you want to organize the day, die, married. If you've been up for diaspora, where you go down, you must show proof so you support the liberation with the land secure the ground for you before you go. Otherwise, you're going to breach this law. The leader for our war of liberation, he give one example. Say sometime it will be for for a long time where Italy, it be the one claim saying that they get control for northern Ethiopia and it be the site international law. But Russia and France, they be denied, say it not be so because say, uh, Italy, it never show proof of effective uh, government businesses within Ethiopia, northern Ethiopia. So Cameroon also, they need for position today with the not show proof for business as usual within our territory. So Ambazonia, it not defeat Cameroon as an occupying force. That was the message where the leader of our war of liberation again for we this year. He also outlined a vision for 2022. Say by August for 2022, as we would implement a policy for self governance by August, it will announce for the Ambazonian people if we would attend the level where we get into that phase of total government for ground zero. So by August this year, we will know a big job for we for implement this policy. And if I may go know so that during the implementation phase, we will all the work together. Fellow Ambazonians, 